All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Saipo, and this is Fallout New Vegas Part 31 with Nova and Veronica. And I've decided, after considering it and sleeping on it, it just, it just makes. I mean, I hate. There might be amazing loot in there, but it just makes sense. Farms like feed so so many in a world where there's already enough, not enough food to go around. Without knowing who these people are, I have to I have to shut this down. It may result in meltdown. As part of safety protocol, this action has been locked out from this terminal. Using the master override terminal located in the reactor room will bypass all safety features. All vault controls to another terminal. This action cannot be undone. As part of safety protocol, this action has been locked out from this terminal. Using the master override terminal located in the reactor room will bypass all safety procedures. Okay, so do we have to open the reactor door anyway? Okay. Jesus. I mean, it looks like there's just gonna be more ghouls in there. The dwellers are probably just ghouls. Seal external ventilation. Apparently we gained NCR fame for that. And quest done. Veronica, I'm coming. I know, I don't I don't feel safe with that either. Let's get out of here, because if we're sealing vents, that's that sounds like a, a reactor meltdown waiting to happen. So time to leave. This place was very profitable. Um, one of the less interesting vaults, honestly that I've ever been in, but we got a lot of really good loot, experience. We got to test out Veronica proper. She actually got involved in quite a few fights here, so even if it was one of the less interesting vaults, I'd say this was a very worthy um, use of our time. Yeah, we've been down there, okay. Uh, now, how do we get back up? And I think if we use one more rat away, that should be good for a while. There we go. Let's book it out of here. You're kidding me. Again, seemingly spawning, but maybe we did miss this room because the desk also had stuff in it. Did we actually miss, like, a way down into that main room? <laughs> Am I just really bad at this game? Possibly. It wouldn't blow my mind too much. Two shots? Ah, uh, one shot. Nice crit, though. Go get him, Veronica. Oh my god, that gun is acting up right now. Don't like that at all. But we don't have anything to repair it with. some things. Huh. I, I mean, it's possible we just missed this area. I guess. And then the main entrance is this way. Okay. Sure. Maybe we just got distracted and never saw that one room. Oh, here's where we were supposed to find our first journal fragment. Sixty-four was the first one. Population continues to grow unhindered. With the overcrowding came violence. It was nothing at first, but quickly escalated with the open access to firearms in the armory. The armory door was not at the time connected to the main system and could not be locked. So I placed guards at the armory door to prevent some of the more troublesome residents from obtaining weapons. There was some opposition to this, but the majority of the residents seemed to agree. Yeah, it didn't work out. I'm just letting you know. Okay, so that's Vault 34. To be honest, no grand plans here for where to head next. So, just in the general direction of the vault. Maybe we're heading for the Crimson Caravan Company next? Gunrunners, Crimson Caravan, and the Medical Clinic. Those are all pretty close. This is way off the beaten path. We'll go to that later. I kind of want to go to the Strip as soon as we can um, without skipping anything on the way, obviously. Not as fast as we can or we would have been there 20 parts ago, right? 
but without skipping things on the way, I want to see how fast we can get to the strip here. And watch us hit 20 right before we get to the strip, so we end up turning around and doing Honest Hearts first, too. We'll see. Okay. Back in the open world. It is nighttime. I wonder what day it is. 11.01. That would mean it's day... 13 since we entered the wasteland. Oh, more golden geckos. Okay. I guess I should have expected that. And when the crits weren't needed, they vanished. Nice punch. I don't know why I'm even looking at them. I know they're not going to have anything that valuable on them. Hello, hello. Goodbye, goodbye. Okay, back towards the strip, because look how close we are getting. Ooh. <laughs> Assuming we don't hit 20, we could be there in two or three parts, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure Crimson Caravan Company is going to be quite a bit. Uh, they've been talking them up this whole game, but I'm assuming the other locations, the medical clinic and the gun runners, are just going to be, you know, quick stops. Just to say, hey, what's going on at the medical clinic, and hey, what's going on, what are you selling at the gun runners? And enemies. What kind of enemies? Could be any kind of enemy, really. Hey. Ah, just more geckos. We have that easily. And then turn out turn around and execute. Nice. Is that 18? Ooh, no, but it's teasingly close. Oh, it is 18! Level 18. Pop guns up to 91, I guess. I was going to do it to 93 because we'd already read one skill book that gave us a three bonus, but 91 guns, and then we'll just find three more skill books, hopefully, to bump that up to 100. And for now, we'll leave that there. So, now that we've finished with guns, I think sneak comes next. And then we're going to have to figure out. So, sneak until level 20, and then after we hit level 20, we'll have to decide what skill is next. Okay, we need better criticals. We are crushing the criticals. Infiltrator, the only new thing. Uh, when if Infiltrator, if a lock is broken, can't normally be picked again. You can, Oh, no. You can attempt to pick it again one more time. This includes locks previously broken by a force lock attempt. That sounds awful. Definitely better criticals. Pop that. Boom. And then the next perk will be challenging again, because we still need another toughness. We need action girls. All kinds of stuff. Is this just a bridge marker? I'm just headed towards this compass marker. Durable Dunn's Sacked Caravan. Oh my god, buff out. Hello. Oh yeah. Crimson Caravan Guards are dead. Whoa. With very valuable stuff, too. Oh my god, very valuable stuff. Hello. Oh my goodness. A Van Graff Thug. So Crimson Caravan Guard and Van Graff Thug. And she can't care anymore. Damn it. Okay, we're at our limit here. We'll repair this one with this one. And then boom. No, that's still too little. Okay. There we go. Okay. We really need to hit one of those shops. We are finally hitting our weight limit, even with um, the addition of Veronica to our ranks of being able to carry stuff. There's the caravan itself, I guess. I've heard that some of these are rigged to blow, is why I was approaching it so cautiously. I don't remember who told us that and when, but somebody did tell us that they were prepping dead caravans to blow, so better safe than sorry. I hope we made the right call with that sharecropper farm thing. Isaac house. Who is Isaac? I don't know who that is. And he's not here at the moment, so... Ugh, tempting. We also have a ton of Sunset Sarsaparilla I should have been drinking instead of repairing weapons. 
That would have been way more profitable of a venture. Okay, we got a location there. Hostetler home. Which is not sneaking around. Hello, Hostetlers? No? These are rooms, I guess. Star bottle cap? Hey! Oh, they're here. They're just asleep. Don and Mrs. Hot... Don and Mrs. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Don. Hello there. Welcome to the Crimson Caravan Company. How can I help you today? Okay, so he's Crimson Caravan. Who are you? The name's Hostetler. Don Hostetler. Can I help you with something? Who are you? I already told you I'm Don Hostetler. <laughs> is there any work to be had here? You know, hiring isn't really my department. You should talk to Miss McLafferty about work for hire. Miss McLafferty? Like I said, talk... Yeah, I'm just making him repeat stuff. Sorry, man. That was kind of a... Hey there. I'm apparently not a very good listener. Hello, Mrs. Hostetler. What are you doing here? Get out before I blow your head off. I mean you no harm. Whatever you say, stranger. Go snoop somewhere else and get the fuck out of my house. Right now. Wow. I just want to ask you some questions. Are you deaf? Okay. Get lost. Jesus. Aggressive, Veronica. We're clearly not wanted. Like, really not wanted. That was aggressive. Okay. Medical Clinic and Crimson Caravan Company are right here. I was kind of thinking of going to Gunrunners first, but if this is closer, we'll just knock that out. Is that the wall of the strip? There's a way over there, too. I just saw him go beyond that wall. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Three locations now. There's the Crimson Caravan entrance. Got it. And then the medical clinic will be right over here. Let's go, Veronica. Day 13 in the Wasteland. I'd say we're doing pretty good. Is that a rabid Brahmin? Sorry to hear that, man. But don't worry about it. I killed you. No worries. 80 crippled enemy heads. That's no joke. Mole Rat Ranch. Uh, this Brahmin clearly killed them all. And I thought I was going towards the clinic. Okay. I guess clinic is this way. Is it like bordering the... Uh, Crimson Caravan Company? I'm confused. Is this the clinic? New Vegas Medical Clinic. Oh yeah, my bad. What is that design? It's just a stick person or X person? I don't know. Ooh, an X person. That sounds deadly. Yo, clinic guard. Meeting people, not gonna just steal it. are always on the look for new friends like yourself. Okay, so it's followers. Another clinic guard. They're very... A lot of guards here. Okay. Where is... Where is the dock? Exactly. Oh, hello. What is... Medical cabinet. That noise scared me. A little stim pack. Nobody will notice it's gone. Not very good guards, just saying. Dr. Usanagi, that's who we're supposed to see. Followers. The followers are always on the lookout for new friends like yourself. Interesting. Okay. Dr. Usanagi. Hey, hey. Welcome to the New Vegas Medical Clinic. I'm a fully qualified physician and can fix whatever is wrong with you for a reasonable fee. If you've got the caps, I've also got several implants available to enhance your physical attributes. Ooh. <laughs> You s <laughs> you sell plants too? Uh, tell me about the clinic. Everything you see is funded by the We might have found somewhere to spend some money with we our caps. We a lot on charity to provide low-cost medical services to the less fortunate. Okay. Are you one of the followers of the apocalypse? Yes, I am. I received my medical training at the Angels Boneyard Medical University back in the NCR. It's not a requirement to be a follower to enter the university, but I believe in what they do, so I joined them. And what do they believe in? We believe that technology for basic necessities like food, water, and medicine should be shared, not hoarded. We're also strongly in favor of proper education. I've come across more than a few doctors whose techniques came out of the back of a magazine. 
I don't completely hate that. Are the followers part of the NCR? We've worked with them in the past. The NCR became too focused on things like patents and profitability, so the followers go their own way now. The NCR and the followers have a cool relationship at the moment. We see them as oppressive, and they view us as anarchists. Well, at least she's aware of both sides. And they have a headquarters anywhere? Yes, the Mormon Ford in Freeside. It's hard to miss. We've set, we've heard that, actually, and it's hard to miss. Good to know. All right. You sell plants, too? Uh, no. Implants, not plants. They're little machines I can put inside <laughs> you to make you faster, quicker, or smarter. I recommend the smarter implant. <laughs> I've also got two much more expensive implants. One's a subdermal implant that will make you more resistant to damage. Huge? The other implant induces a mild regenerative effect. Your wounds will practically heal before your eyes. Practically, okay. Uh, you sell plants? Do you sell anything here? I have reserved a small part of my supplies for sale. The profits go directly to the purchase of additional supplies to help the less fortunate. Show me what you have for sale. Because you're a friend of the followers, I can give you a bit of a discount. Good to know. 2,500 caps. Ooh. Nice. Ooh, super, super stim packs are pretty good. No turbo, though. Just saying. I really want turbo. We have 10 super stim packs. I'll think about it. We might come back for these super stim packs one day. These ranger hats are worthless. Worthless! Alright, I'm gonna sell 14 rad X. 280 caps there. Um, nine purified water, I guess? Pulse gun. We don't need pulse mines if we have a pulse gun, I suppose. I'll sell one. 200! That's right, we got 226 <laughs> free war money from that one dude. That one dead body, that was big. Plasma rifle, plasma pistol. Pencil. Uh, missile launcher. We don't need a missile launcher. Minigun would be so fun. But it's strength 10, we're not strong enough anyway. She sells implants though, so let's see. Mentats. Lever action shotgun that we got, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not selling the goby, that's for damn sure. Goby's fantastic. That combat armor is worth so much. Kind of crazy how much it's worth, actually. So are these C4 explosives. Ooh, tempting. We might sell those as well. This All-American's not going to cut it. I don't see us using that for very long, but, you know... We'll sell other stuff for now, while we still can, easily. 2198, and I know we have a bunch of stuff on Veronica, a bunch of stuff on Veronica. Let's see. Sell the sniper rifle, it's not as good as the Gobi, that's a given. And then the grenades, we can sell... 11 and that'll be just shy but how shy oh job just shy i'll even sell one 556 round there we go Thirty-three thousand caps we have money i want to buy an implant one other thing i forgot to mention your body may be able to handle only a limited number of implants the healthier you are okay. the more implants i'll be able to give you now what surgery are you considering I'd like to have more muscles. Make me see better. Can you make me tougher? Got anything to make people like me better? I want to be smarter. Do you have anything, something to make me quicker? Can you make me luckier? Sub what? I'm interested in that. I'd like the regenerating ability. Um. What's like most important? I'd love to have 10 luck. Let's, let's do that first. If I implant the probability calculator in your frontal lobe, you'll be able to calculate odds a little better. Sure, let's it's do not that. It's quite the same as making you luckier. Ooh, these that are you'll pricey. Be able to nudge things your way more often. I can do the implant for 4000 caps. Jesus, that's a lot of money. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. A few hours, okay. How long is a few hours? 
It's almost 8 in the morning, okay. Dude, 4,000 for that one. Uh, there it is. 10 luck, look at that! Okay. So if we raise stats, our Charisma and Intelligence are bottom tier. Uh, we might as well make her better at what she's already good at. One more Intelligence wouldn't suck, Charisma wouldn't suck. I don't understand the limit on how many implants I can have, though. You're back. Do you need medical attention? Want to buy an implant? All right. Let me do a quick test. To don't say sure no right away. Handle another implant. All right. You're healthy enough to handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? Beautiful. Uh, what's next most important? Agility sub what? That was something that made us more resistant to damage. I feel like that's more important. That would be the Nemian sub. Oh my armor. goodness! The prices. Eight thousand caps, but the implant causes your skin cells to be bolstered with iron. Ooh. It won't make you bulletproof, but it will make you a little harder to injure. That sounds pretty dope. Have a seat in the auto dock. Eight thousand caps. Oh, oh. Our money. We just spent twelve thousand caps. Worth it. Worth it. What's our DT now? 17, that seems kind of low. Oh, it's 17. And we get 3 from toughness, I think. So, 4? Unless I'm forgetting about something else, 4 is kind of low. 4 more DT for 8,000 caps. Maybe it'll end up being worth it. You're back. I'm, uh, wait, how long did that take? Oh yeah, it takes like three and a half hours to put You're these back. in. I want to buy an implant. All right, let me do a quick test to make sure your body can handle another implant. All right, You're nice. Nice. To handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? All right, next up, uh, stronger would mean I could carry more and would raise our strength like ability with other weapons. So let's do that. I can implant the hypertrophy accelerator for four thousand caps. Okay, so it the special increases glass, seem to be worth 4,000. Here's the caps. Have a seat in the auto dock. 16,000 caps down. Yours. Dehydration level increase. Oh yeah, we've we've been uh we've been suffering because we have just been passing time, haven't we? Uh, food is at 2.99. We're actually gonna need sleep soon, so let's do an atomic cocktail because sleep is for the week. And then we need to drink a few waters here. 103, 299, 2. Yeah, we need we need food though. You're back. I want to buy an implant. All right. Let me keep going. Let me do a quick test to make sure your body can handle another implant. All right. You're healthy enough to handle another one. <sighs> Is that just mean full health? Because if it's full health, then yeah, I can do this all day. Uh, can you make me tougher? Got anything to make people like me better? What does better mean? Oh, make people like me better. Got it. Uh, maybe I do need to be smarter. <laughs> uh, I don't know about the regenerating ability over just pure special increases because we we have healing items and we're not running short anytime soon. Uh, quicker, smarter, better, make me see better. Tougher. Tougher is good. We need to survive. The nociception regulator modifies your cardiovascular system, and you won't tire as quickly. The price is 4,000 caps, same as most other implants. Here you go. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. Okay, that's 20,000 caps we've now burnt on this clinic. Jesus Christ. 313 on food. We need to drink another purified water. Maybe you shouldn't have sold all those purified waters, Typo. What are you doing? Okay, let's take a look at our special if they let us do any more. Right now we're at minus one on strength, so it's at seven. And that's because of our hunger, yeah. Eight perception, nine endurance. We just did that. Uh, let's do agility and perception first, I guess. Let's do agility and perception first. Hey. You're back. Do you need... Because we, we tanked our intelligence and charisma on purpose. Let's, they're not worth All right. doing Let it me do if, they, if we have other options first. Dude, this is just going to be the, the implant episode. 
Uh, make me quicker. The I'd rather have agility than perception exactly if this cuts me says. off. Speeds up your reaction times. For 4,000 caps, I can attach the implant to your central nervous node. Here's the caps. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. All right, we've got to be running out of chances on this, unless it is just full health, in which case I'm just going to buy all of them or until we run out of money. We're down to 9,000 caps. That's 24,000 caps we've spent. You're back. Do you Want to buy an implant? All right. Let Come me on! Do a test to make sure your body can handle another implant. All right. You're healthy enough to handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? Make me see better. The optics enhancer, as the name suggests. That does kind of sound Cyberpunk 2077-ish, and that sounds the dope. The price is 4,000 caps. Dude, direct, directly the optic nerve? What kind of sci-fi science is all Have this? I guess this all dog. has been, hasn't this it? This will take a few hours. Wow, we are spending a whole day in this clinic getting absolutely chipped up. This is more chipping than I do in Cyberpunk. Holy shit. We're t we've spent 28,000 caps. They're all gone. They're all gone. Can I still do more? Right. Let me do a quick test to make sure your body can handle another implant. All right. Wow. You're healthy enough to handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? It just lets us keep going. All right. It's these three left. Uh, charisma, intelligence, and the regenerating ability. I guess the regenerating ability isn't the end of the world. Like, we tanked these on purpose, right? That's the Phoenix Monocyte Breeder. The implant speeds up cell regeneration, an effect similar to that of some lizards and sea creatures. The implant is very expensive. Health. Oh my! 12,000 caps. Goodness, we'll be back. Very well. <laughs> we'll be back. Take care. Bye. Oh my god, 12,000 caps for the next thing? Wow. Well, we have 5,700 caps now, and of course, Veronica's loaded with goods for when we get to the gun runners. We can sell them th that, those stuff. Wow, but we are chipped up. <laughs> Look at our special now. That's going to be 8 once we get rid of our hunger, and then that should be 8 also. 9, 1, 1, 8, 10. 10 luck. That has to be the bobblehead equivalent in this game. There's no way. We haven't seen a bobblehead yet in this game. Crimson Caravan Company. Hey there. It's Ringo! Here's the rest of the payment I promised you back in Good Springs. Thank you, my man. Who's in charge here? 150 caps Alice and McLafferty something. McLafferty runs the Crimson Caravan. You can find her over in the main office. We spent a whole day in that clinic, basically. It's night again. So what's next for you? I'm getting ready to run a caravan up towards Utah. There's a town called New Canaan, which is supposed to be pretty prosperous. The Crimson Caravan doesn't have any branches out that way. So it'll be up to me to get things started. Pretty big responsibility. What are the rules of caravan? It's yeah, tell me. It's a two-player game, and the winner takes the whole pot. You build a caravan using the cards in your deck. The goal is to create caravan bids that beat your opponent's bids. So there's more strategy than luck involved. It's why you won't see caravan in any casino. Too slow paced. And more importantly, no house edge. Here, uh -huh. take this holotape. It goes into more specifics about the rules. You'll also need a deck, so take one of my spares. That would have been so, nice to get a long time ago. Do you feel like playing a game? Uh, where can I find more cards? Just keep an eye out for them while you travel. Oh, that's why there's I cards. cards in old boxes or forgotten on shelves. You can find some for sale too. All right, I don't have time for a game right now. All right. I'll try to I'll figure out the around. rules to that off Pretty camera, I suppose. But she knows what she's it's a whole doing card now. game. Is that a person? No, she's a guard. Okay. Well, there's actually like unopenable buildings, and this place isn't that big. A lot of Brahmin though. That person looks unique. Like this one right here. Boss. Nope, she just care of here. Alright, what's up, uh, Blake? If you're looking to buy or sell, you've come to the right man. The Crimson Caravan Company has the widest selection in the wasteland. Can you answer some questions for me? Maybe. What do you want to know? Where does the Crimson Caravan Company get its merchandise? Trade routes, my friend. Trade routes. Just about every major town in the wasteland has a Crimson Caravan branch in it. Ever have trouble from bandits? Out here, we usually split our caravans into smaller bands. That way, we don't lose everything if they get hit. Yeah, it's but they're easier to hit. Though. But hopefully, we'll be able to start running larger caravans once things get civilized. 
Yeah, once the Legion brings civilization, I agree. Where are you from? A little place in the NCR called Oak Creek. Used to be a farming town until it got taken over by ranchers. I didn't want to herd Brahmin for a living, so I signed on with the Crimson Caravan and headed east. Not much to tell, really. All right, that's it for now. Need anything else? What do you got? Can do. 1,500 caps. A lot of cards, but I'd rather just find the cards. Anything big. Anything that, like, screams, gotta have it. Plus 30 ammo on the 9mm. The 9mm is just not good enough. BBs. Mm. Old cowboy hat. No, yeah. As much as I... Tiny, tiny babies. All you need to know about pediatric medicine? Is that a skill book? I'll buy it just in case. I'm willing to lose 30 caps on the chance that it might be a skill book. Stress in the modern refugee a primer? I don't think these are skill books. I might lose 60 caps here for no reason, but... Man, I love raider stuff. Raiders are my favorite faction in, in Fallout games. Definitely will be a raider in Fallout 4. All right, I bought those. Let me get stuff out of Veronica real quick. Goodbye. See ya. Okay. Uh. No. Yeah. Damn it. They're just books. I'm stupid. I'm stupid, Veronica. I got baited. Is something good for me? Is it a dress? I am going to get you a dress. I swear to God, it's happening. Just give me some time, okay? You're gonna have to give me a little more time to find you that dress. Hey there. You looking to buy or sell? I could have just taken the rest of the uh, some machine guns, I guess. I'm about to get rid of all these. First off, take your books back. You scammed me. You won't take them back? Oh, you're a dick. Oh, I should have just done this. Yeah. I didn't even need to do what I just did. Whatever. Uh, 10 millimeter rounds. There we go. Three of them. Alright, there you go. We gotta slowly work on getting our money back up. Back up to 7,400 here. See ya. I wanna hit a casino and make it big. We got 10 luck. We're a lucky girl. We can win some, some casino games. Caravaneer Barracks. Probably nobody important in here, but I'm willing to check. Caravaneer, Caravaneer. What is that? La Fantoma. Caravaneer. Janet. Now we're talking. We have a Janet. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a Janet. Who is Janet? And there's Ringo. You should go talk to Blake or Alice. They handle most of our contact with visitors. Okay, thanks, Janet. Clearly a quest NPC and not someone you can just talk to to talk to. All right, Veronica, let's keep moving. You look ridiculous with that helmet on, and I love you for it. Nobody saw that. Amazingly, we spent so much time on the implants and everything that we're about to run out of time for this episode, but I do want to finish up this Crimson Caravan area. Guard barracks. Just guards? Why does it sound so loud? Like I had whiskey under his bed. I saw that. Don't think I didn't see that. Alice McLafferty, you are throwing me off with the suit and mini skirt into high heel with the pistol on your... Okay, what's Welcome up? Welcome to the Crimson Caravan Company, New Vegas branch. What may I do for you? <sighs> uh, I didn't... I don't have any jobs. I'd like to know more about the Crimson Caravan Company. Certainly. What would you like to know? How long have you been in business? The Crimson Caravan Company has been in business for over 130 years. Huge. We're partially responsible for the progress in the NCR. Do they have any competition? Well, the gunrunners continue to dominate the weapons market. And the Mormon traders from New Canaan control the majority of the northern routes. You're well dressed for this place. Normally, I oversee company operations at the hub in California. 
However, the New Vegas branch has been underperforming in recent years. Given the conditions here, it's not hard to see why. I'll change all that soon enough. Big, she's confident. All right. Is there anything else I can do? For I know you're going to work for me. I'm afraid we have no current openings for caravanners or guards. I was about to say she had I, it's, I thought she was about to say she had no jobs. I'll take it. What do I need to do? Deliver this invoice to Dr. Hilder. You can find him somewhere inside Camp McCarran. Well, there's our in to Camp McCarran, I guess. Very well. What job did you need more information on? Uh, the negotiation. What's the gunrunner job about? What gunrunner job? The quality of the gunrunner's armaments is due to their manufacturing process. They craft all weapons on site. When would we have gotten this quest? I want to know what? The secrets of their manufacturing process. Which means you'll need to find some way to get inside their heavily guarded. Return pack. to Cass. I would greatly prefer that you perform this job undetected and without killing anyone, if it can be helped. All right, I barely paid attention to that. Uh, yikes! I was distracted by it. it said something about Cassidy, about Cass, like my favorite personality in this game so far. Want to know more about the problem with Henry Jameson? I just don't know when we got these quests at all. The Jamesons are very wealthy ranchers back in Redding, California, and significant investors in the Crimson Caravan Company. I was pressured into posting young Henry as the manager of the New Vegas branch. As you can see, he wasn't exactly cut out for the job. He was much more interested in gambling and prostitutes, and because of his family, I can't simply fire him. Henry needs to be convinced to quit, one way or another. I won't have a useless employee on the company payroll. I'm down for that, actually. If they're going to be on the payroll and actually contribute nothing, I'm down for that. Tell me about the negotiation. There's a small trading outfit, Cassidy Caravan. Cassidy! In acquiring. They've been rather competitive, so it's time to buy them out. I have it on good authority that the owner, Cass, wants out of the caravan business. Cass frequently trades with the NCR, so you'll likely find her at the Mojave Outpost. I get to go talk to Cass again. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Was there something else? <laughs> I love that chick. She's great. It's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure. Dude, I'm actually so... St I got a dumb grin on my face right now. I'm actually so stoked. Yeah, Veronica, you're nice too, of course. But I have not enjoyed talking to anyone in this game more than I've enjoyed talking to Cass. From that one play... From the Mojave Outpost. She is where it's at. Worth... So apparently we have a bunch of jobs. So that's interesting. Look how many quests we have. Oh my, oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, this is the Honest Hearts. Yeah, 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 okay. In two levels we'll go do that. Turn to Cass. That is so far away though. But once we're anywhere near that, I will gladly go talk to Cass. A privilege. Um, Camp McCarran. That's not too... Not too far. Uh, left my heart. Find Frank Weather's family. I still don't know what she's talking about with the other jobs. I don't... I don't know those other jobs. She said something about gun runners, but I don't remember what she said about them. Uh, uh, you know what? I'm actually gonna go talk to her again real quick, and then we'll... Yeah, we do have to call this an episode, though. This is... Dragging on, and I got... I <laughs> things to do. Welcome back. I am loving, though. Everything's getting so interested. Okay, uh, tell me about the gunrunner job again. The quality of the gunrunner's armaments is due to the Okay, the craft all weapons on site. Right, I remember that part. I want to know the secrets of their manufacturing process, which means you'll need to find some way to get inside their heavily guarded factory. Ooh. I would greatly prefer that you perform this job undetected and without killing anyone, if it can be helped. Okay, so it's a stealth mission. Hey. Uh, we've... We've not been great at those so far, but our stealth is getting better every day. So, you know, maybe we'll be able to do that soon. Alright, so next time we're going to make it to Gunrunners and we're going to do a little trading. Hopefully, get something a little spicy maybe. So thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. <laughs> God, we're so implanted up, it's crazy. But yeah, thank you so much again for joining Nova, Veronica, and I on this journey in Fallout New Vegas. And we will see... All of you, next time.